If you still haven't been able to create the perfect lead magnet, I'm going to show you in this video how to create a lead magnet with the help of AI. We're going to be using one specific prompt, a lot of context, and a lot of back and forth with the prompting and tools. So if you're ready to finally create something that's going to get more subs, let's go ahead and jump in and learn how to create the perfect lead magnet with the help of this AI prompt. So the whole purpose of building a lead magnet is to turn traffic into email subscribers by providing a valuable free offer. And it has to be something that truly, truly helps them and is a no brainer to exchange their email address for the lead magnet. Now, in order to do this, you need to solve one specific problem with your audience. So if we look at this bad example, we can say for a content creation niche, the complete guide to AI YouTube content. This is way too broad. It's not clear and doesn't solve something specific. Now, a good example would be a five minute AI script template for viral YouTube shorts. As you can see that we're targeting something very specific and people are going to know exactly what they're going to get in that lead magnet. And this is going to be very helpful for us with our future emails as well. So some of the lead magnet examples and types that you can create are checklists, template bundles, swipe files, resource lists, a free mini course, worksheets, audit templates, and maybe even a free case study video, depending on your niche. So let's say you're in the fitness niche, you might want to give someone like a checklist and that could be a daily workout routine. Let's say you're in the marketing space and you are in the email marketing niche, then you could probably give someone swipe files of your best email templates. So you want to think about your niche and you really want to think about how you can help your audience and choose the right template. So what we're going to do from here is we're going to create our lead magnet with the help of AI. So you can go ahead and choose a specific tool. You can use ChatGPT or Claude, and then we're going to use this detailed prompt template and we're going to gather existing resources and examples, basically our own context. And then we're going to use this lead magnet builder, which is going to help us create that entire lead magnet. All right. So this is the exact lead magnet builder that we use and many of my students use to build their own lead magnets. So one of the things that we teach in the community generate is how to create your I help statement and also understanding exactly what your content pillars are. I'm going to drop this lead magnet builder prompt in the bottom of this video. So you want to make sure that you understand who your niche is and also know exactly what your content pillars are. This is exactly kind of saying what your categories are. So if I'm in the you know YouTube content strategy niche, then that could be audience growth, content ideation, and that could also be community building, right? So you want to think about what your content pillars are. And once you understand what those are, then you can use this prompt to come up with the perfect five high converting lead magnet examples. So what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to copy this and then add it to your favorite AI tool. And then we're going to go ahead and start building our lead magnet from here. So once you insert this prompt, it's going to go ahead and ask us for what our I help statement is and also our niche and any of our main content pillars. So for this example, we're going to say I help freelance copywriters double their income by mastering AI copywriting tools. The niche is freelance copywriters who want to integrate AI into their business without losing their competitive edge. And then we have our content pillars. Our first content pillar is just AI tool mastery for copywriters, human AI collaboration when we're editing, and then AI enhanced business growth. So this is pretty, pretty straightforward. You want to try to add in as much context as possible. You could even include like your unique angle, maybe your unique value proposition, who you serve and all of those things, but try to add as much context. So once we insert this prompt, it's going to go ahead and give us five different unique lead magnet examples. So as we're doing this, you can see that it's building out that strategic lead magnet type. And we're going to have really, really good examples here. As you can see, I already like the first one, which is the 15 minute AI prompt framework, right? Converting copy two times faster. And it's going to say that the format should be a PDF template or framework. The components would be fill in the blank prompt templates before and after examples, troubleshooting guide for AI prompting, the paid offer connection. So that upsell would be an AI prompting course for copywriters. Now that is really good. The second one is amazing as well as seven day AI copywriting challenge. I actually think this is really, really good too. And it could be an email challenge with worksheets. We also have another one for creating a service menu template for copywriters. So they could use that to package their services to command premium rates as a ghostwriter. We have a quality control checklist. This one's actually pretty cool. And then we have a client communication kit. So all of these are actually really, really nice. And I'm not going to lie. I would use probably four out of five of these. So we're just going to go ahead and continue with one example 
and see what kind of lead magnet it can create for us. So don't forget that even though we're gonna have it created for us, if you can continue editing this further and making any small adjustments and improvements to your lead magnet, this is just gonna make it even better for yourself. Now this used to take me probably a few days to maybe even a week. Now I'm able to create lead magnets for my students, for myself in less than a day. Now we're gonna go ahead and use number four as our lead magnet type, which is the 10 point AI quality control checklist. Now I'm also telling it to provide a bonus step here, which we can create a brand voice using that to further edit and humanize our AI generated content. So I'm gonna have it write the whole thing and make sure that it provides an amazing checklist for us to use. You can see that it's creating the entire checklist and I love how it even provides directions and how to use the checklist. So we're gonna get some pretty good quality control information. So from here, you can go ahead and make sure that everything looks good. If there's anything that we're missing here or that you want to include, then we can definitely do that. Now I see here that I definitely wanna maybe include some examples. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell the AI to add example outputs so it can actually have our subscribers see what exactly we're trying to explain in the lead magnet. So this is perfect. It's going ahead and providing us with an example output. And you can see that in the quality control for basic error check example is AI wrote, the product will help you save time, save energy, and save time in your business. Fixed, the product helps you save both time and energy in your business. Same thing with the scan, same thing with flow and structure. So this is gonna really, really make our lead magnet even better because we're providing examples. And this is gonna help our subscribers feel like we're really putting a lot of effort into this free offer. So our next step, once we built this entire thing, we're gonna go ahead and wanna use a tool like Gamma AI to help us create the entire lead magnet. And we're gonna use that because what Gamma does is that it provides a share link, which we can provide with our audience in our emails. And they can use that to go ahead and either duplicate the Gamma or just keep it as a bookmarked resource. And this makes it easier for us to update that lead magnet and also add any call to actions like buttons. So we're gonna use their awesome AI feature and we're gonna go ahead and get started. But again, this is not a sponsored video. I actually use Gamma as you can see for my entire business. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on create new with AI. And then from here, we're gonna go ahead and click on paste in text. I'm gonna copy this entire lead magnet that we created in Claude. And I'm gonna paste that entire thing in here. So if there's anything that you need to further edit, just in case, go ahead and do so. But we're gonna go ahead and keep it like this. We're gonna use presentation style and click on continue. Now on the left-hand side, we're gonna have some information we can either adjust. So we can text generate our shorter and condensed wording. We can also change the max text per card. We can also change the output language. We can include AI images. So I'm gonna just say like anime lo-fi style. And I'm gonna keep the format the exact same. From here, I'm gonna go ahead and just either keep eight cards, or I'm, but I'm gonna do 10 for the sake of this video. And I'm gonna click on continue. So from here, we can go ahead and pick a theme that we would want for our gamma. And I'm gonna use this one here because this one looks pretty cool. And I'm gonna click on generate. So as you can see, it's creating our entire lead magnet for us. It looks really, really nice. We can go ahead and change the background color in a bit, but you can see it's even including the images. I mean, this looks amazing already, and we're gonna let it do its thing while either we're you know, drinking our coffee or doing whatever we wanna do, but this is really, really powerful in a way where this used to take me 30 minutes to an hour to create the slide deck. Now I can just do this in a few minutes. All right, so you can see that it created the entire gamma for us. I think it looks really good. Now, if there's anything further that you need to edit, you can go ahead and do so, but you can see how amazing and simplified this is. If there's some things that you don't like, you can also change the image if you need to. And we can edit with AI. We can change the card styling here. But I mean, overall, I think everything looks pretty good in my opinion. Now, one thing I'm gonna do is I can change the background color. So if I can click on theme here and then click on customize, we can change the color palettes for this entire Gamma slide presentation. We can also change the font style. We can include our logo and we have any other design elements here. So I can make this round. I can remove the shadow that we just saw. We're gonna keep it like that. We can change really anything. We can also change the image style that we had from the AI deck. Now I can go back and actually just go ahead and keep on editing and click on save. From here, I can also click on page setup and I can actually change the entire background of this here. So I'm gonna click on 
solid color. And I'm just gonna use kind of more a bluish kind of vibe here. Okay, perfect. Now we have an entire lead magnet that we can use for our business. And people can also present this, so you can present it as well. But we can click on present, and now we have this setup here. It looks really, really nice. I mean, this is insane. You can also add in some more call to action. So at the end of this, we can go ahead and escape here. And then what we can do is we can click on add a blank card. And then we can also say join our course plus community if you have one. You can go ahead and put that in the middle here. And then here we can just have a quick snippet like if you enjoyed this, you will love my community. And then we can click on slash here and we can click on add a button. Now we have a button. We can go ahead and center align that here and we can add in a specific text. But now we have this and we can have people join our community and they can have our lead magnet as well. So I think this is a really cool way to really, really just build out a perfect lead magnet strategy. And then you could input this into your YouTube channel. You can add this to your website and really just anywhere that your audience is searching for. So if I were you, and once you have that lead magnet, you're gonna wanna add it to your YouTube description. So you can add it at the bottom here. You can also add it in your pinned comment section right here. And you could imagine this video got 58,000 views. So even if just two to 3% of people were to opt into your list, that would be a huge amount of opportunity, not just for your business, but for potential sponsorships, affiliate marketing companies that you wanna work with and just building your business in general, this is the smartest path when it comes to building a legitimate content business for yourself. Now, another place you can do is you can add this to your website. So if you were to go to my website here and just look at any of my articles, you could see that on the right hand side, I have a sticky sidebar that provides a free blog audit cheat sheet. They can enter their email, submit, and they can join my email list. So this is another very powerful way to not only collect leads, but potentially bring in sales and also building potential business opportunities for yourself. So this is the smartest path when it comes to building a lead magnet strategy. So go out there and build out your own lead magnet with the help of AI. And if you wanna continue learning any different ways to use AI for your business, you can watch these videos next. I can't wait to see what you do with this prompt. I'll see you in the next video, bye.